The government has given approval to the Gratis Foundation to establish the Gratis University College of Applied Technology. The university will provide practical training to the youth in line with the government's initiative of industrializing the nation. The Deputy Minister for Trade and Industry, Mr. Kweku Ricketts Hagan, has visited the Eastern Regional Office of the Foundation to see the level of preparedness towards the running of the university college. The University College aims, among other things, to bridge the gap between academia and industry, produce engineers and technicians trained academically and practically, and reduce the skills gap needed on the African continent. It will run courses including automobile engineering, computer engineering, and machine design, among others. The Chief Executive Officer of Gratis, Mr. Emmanuel Siedu, noted that practical training equips the youth with the necessary knowledge and skills to help solve the numerous challenges confronting the country. Imports far outweigh exports, as all of us know, affecting our dollar here and there. Ghana imports almost everything, including matches and toothpick. Then I asked the question, why? And why don't you produce them here? Because we like the technology. We like the skills, knowledge to be able to do that. The infrastructure at the Gratis Center in Kofoidia was upgraded to be used as one of the campuses of the university to train about 1,268 youth in employable skills. The Deputy Minister of Trade and Industry, Mr. Kweku Rickert Hagen, said Ghana can only become a manufacturing economy if it industrializes. Employment is one of the biggest problems that we face in this country. But it is not just because we don't have jobs, you know, for the youth, but usually you find out that there is a, a gap between the skills and, 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 and uh, that they have and what the, what the jobs are looking for. The board chairman of Gratis Foundation, Mr. David Atogia, spoke on the need for the establishment of the college, adding that Gratis also has the mandate to promote industrialization to boost the country's economy. The school is expected to roll its first badge of students next year with the Tema and Kofoidia offices as centers.